Hi, I'm Matthew Coast, head dating coach and founder at CommitmentConnection.com. And today we're going to talk about signs he loves you. So what are the signs that a man loves you? Let's talk about what those are. So, you know, a lot of times men don't like to admit that they're falling in love. And, and there's a lot of dating advice out there that tell tells a man not to show that he's falling in love uh, for a variety of stupid reasons and it's a very stupid thing but um so a lot of men don't like to show that they're falling in love and, and even more so they don't like to show their emotions and that you know boils down to a whole bunch of different things that stem from childhood uh development and all kinds of stuff like that but uh, we won't get into that but let's you know do talk about the five signs that i have that a guy's falling in love with you or that or that he does love you and so the five signs are this one is he will initiate contact with you and so if a guy is in love with you if he you know falls in love with you he'll be thinking about you a lot and so he'll want to contact you as much as he can and so if he's contacting you if he's initiating the contact with you then that's a great sign that uh, he is in love with you uh, the second one is that he expresses his love to you and this this doesn't have to be saying that he loves you this could be through giving you gifts it could be uh, spending lots of time with you it could be um, uh, doing things for you, right? Doing some kind of act for you or service for you. It could be uh, helping you with things that you do. Um, uh, it, it could be uh, uh, touching you, guys that are fall in love with women. Um, they a lot of times they will express their love through touch. Um, and the other one is is obviously saying that he loves you and saying, you know, I love you or, or saying love a lot, you know, because he's kind of afraid to say that he loves you, which is something that uh, sometimes guys will do. Um, and then the the third one, the third sign is that he tries to protect you, right? He tries to defend you or he takes your side. And, and this can be even if it doesn't make sense for him to take your side, and especially if it doesn't make any sense for him to take your side. Um, guys feel like it's their role to defend and protect women, you know? And, and so if he is in love with you, he will defend you and he will protect you. And that is a great sign that he is in love with you. Uh, the next one is uh, he wants you to meet his friends and family. And if he's embarrassed of his friends and family, this might be a difficult one. Um, but uh, if he does want you to meet his friends and family, that's a great sign that he's in love with you. Um, and then the last sign is that he talks about or hints at some type of future with you. And so if he starts talking about the two of you together in the future, um, you know, that's a great sign that, uh, that, that he's in love. Um, and, and the more of these that you see him doing, the more likely it is that he's in love. You know, he could talk about you in the future and not think about and, and not be in love. He could initiate contact with you and not be in love. But if he's doing all of these things or most of them, then he's probably in love with you. So that's it for today. If you want more information on how to attract a quality man into a committed, lasting relationship, make sure you go to my website at commitmentconnection.com and take the quiz. I'm Matthew Coast, and I'll speak with you again soon.